Everyone, Cody from Mac Telecom Networks. About a year ago, I did a video on the Wi-Fi Man app by Ubiquity. But now they've released a really cool feature, which is this new Signal Mapper. The Signal Mapper will make a heat map scan of your home or your business as you're walking through your house with the augmented reality features. In this video, we'll take a look at all that the Wi-Fi Man app can do, as well as taking a look at the new Signal Mapper. If you're new here, please hit the subscribe button. Make sure to hit the bell icon. If you'd like to hire me for network consulting, visit www.mactelecomnetworks.com. And if you'd like to support the channel, we do have memberships available and you could join under the video below. So first, let's take a look at some of the features with the Wi-Fi Man app. As you can tell, I'm connected to my SSID called Dolores, and we could see my last speed test. From this page, we could do a speed test and we could specify the test server. Let's run a speed test now. All right, and now the results are in and we're getting 217.4 megabits per second down and 36.1 up. We could see my public IP and it's connecting to the U6 Lite and it's my iPhone. We could see the physical mode is 802.11ax, which is Wi-Fi 6. And we could see the signal is minus 68 dBm. We could also see the channel that I'm using, which is channel 36 on 40 megahertz. And we're connecting to Ubiquity Toronto, Canada. Next, we could do a discover. And what that's going to do, it will show us all the devices that are on this subnet. Okay, and it found 21 devices on Dolores. We could see my Mac Telecom Gateway, which is my UDM Pro. We have some iPhones, some Android devices, and a couple laptops on here. So that's pretty cool if you need to find an IP of a device and to see what's on the subnet. And under the Wi-Fi signal, we could see a couple things. We could see I'm connected to Rogers Communication Canada. That's my ISP. We could see my public IP address as well as my UDM Pro. And then it shows that I'm connected to this U6 Lite access point. If we scroll down, we could see I'm connected to my iPhone 11 and my Wi-Fi experience is 99%. We could see the AP model, the AP name, the SSD, the physical mode, which is that Wi-Fi 6. And we could see the physical download and upload as well as channel and the signal. Now let's click on the start signal mapper. So there's a couple different things in the signal mapper. We could see the signal strength and this will show us our DBM. Currently I'm at minus 65, which is good, but it keeps fluctuating up and down. We could also do a throughput and this is gonna show us the megabits per second that's going through. We could also see the signal strength, the physical mode, and the physical speed. And then we could check out the stability, which is showing us all the same things up top. But down below, it's showing us the milliseconds and I'm connected to my Dolores SSID on the Wi-Fi 6 light access point. And this is where the new feature comes into play. This is the floor plan mapper. We could click on the floor plan mapper and this is initializing the augmented reality within the Wi-Fi Man app. I'm using an iPhone 11 and it doesn't support Linder. If you have an iPhone 12 or higher, it supports Linder and will give you a better map reading, but this will do just fine for what we need. I took some video footage on my iPhone using the floor plan maker. So let's take a look. We could see on the screen that it's starting to create the map. And if we point the camera to the floor, it actually says floor. And we could see as we're walking away from the access point that the DBM is going down and we could tell that it's showing on a wall and it's creating a full map for us. This tool will be really good to plan out your Wi-Fi networks and it will really work well in businesses. One thing I did notice is that I didn't roam to any other access points. I still stayed on my U6 Pro. So that means I need to make some adjustments within my access points. But overall, we are still getting a fair signal even in my main floor when my U6 Pro was upstairs. But I would want this to roam to my main floor access point, which is an in-wall HD. For being a free tool, you can't really ask for much more. But I was looking at some of the Ubiquity forums and some people had some questions. They were saying, I wish there was a way to export the map. And that is on their roadmap, apparently. This was from a UI employee. So that would be really cool if we could export the maps after we're done doing the heat map scan or the floor plan maker. Let me know what you think about this new improvement on the Wi-Fi Man app down in the comments below. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up button. If you're new here, please subscribe and hit the bell icon. All right, thanks.